Hey guys, welcome back to another video of Kingdom of Love 1. And here I'm going to show you guys what do I chop up for peanut. Not, not every day. So please do not do this every single day. This is just what I like to give him just for kind of like a snack or something to change it up um, for, the, for a week. I think this is the second time this week because he has been eating brown food way too much and so I'm deciding to give him some new stuff. So the first thing we are going to want to give him, I'm going to actually give him a quick snack. His, actually, he likes like, his favorite snack is actually watermelon, but we don't, I don't got watermelon. Oh, actually, I think I actually do. Oh, oh well. But here we're going to cut up some strawberries for him because he still likes strawberries. I know, right? And then, here's the cute little green bowl. And then we're just going to cut up some other stuff. No, do not give your hamster strawberries only just for new foods. That is really bad and can get them very sick because fruits are like sweet treats to them. So, um, it can, they could get sick, they will have to go to the vet immediately. So he is just going to get a little piece, because he's only a little baby, so he gets a little piece. So, I'm going to pause you guys, and I'm going to get um, a strawberry out for you guys, for, or for him. Yeah, See, catch you back later. So guys, I just cut up um, a small piece of some strawberry for him, and yeah from this strawberry. We could always use this strawberry again for him. Probably next week. Or if he be good tomorrow. And then probably I'll give him another one. A very small piece tomorrow. Because, yeah. If he be's good. But yeah, so that's one thing that I like to cut up for him when I'm making homemade stuff. Fruits. Second thing. I actually think I have some cabbage for him. Because I cut up some cabbage before. We have some spinach. Some dry spinach. But before I get that, or these are his carrots. I'm going to cut up some carrots for him. And as you guys saw last time, when I cut up some carrots for him, he really did not eat much. But I told him he's going to have to eat them. Because if I only pack carrots in... As his only food, yeah, he would really eat them, but I don't want that to happen and then feel like, oh, carrots all the time, like, you know. So after I finish cutting up his carrots, I'll get back to you guys again.